idea. A great range. Ferguson, 3000 series. Ideas take shape. Wow, what a mood setter that was. Matthew Ferguson obviously meant business when launching their new range. Anyway, nice to have you with us again for our Matthew Ferguson archive series number 24. And in this programme, we'll be looking back to the tractor that promised so much for the future. In the mid-80s, Massey Ferguson invested over $60 million in developing new products, new engineering programmes and capital expenditure in their factories. With that level of investment, their future depended on the new products being a market success. The new 3000 series was designed and developed at the MF factory in Beauvais, France, and was quite a different animal to the 300 series that we featured in volume 23, which was released at the same time but built in Coventry, England. The 3000 series was manufactured with onboard computers and electronic features. It was designed to appeal to the needs and expectations of the professional farmer, usually very large acreage, extremely concerned about productivity and running a highly efficient farming enterprise. It was a brand new clean sheet design, not adapted from previous models, and it was hoped the 3000 series would revolutionise the farming industry. It comprised five models with a choice of three engines. But the real difference was the new computerised operating system MF called Autotronic, which controlled several transmission functions, amongst other things. Another separate computer, called Datatronic, an advanced performance monitor, supplied the driver with a wide range of in-cab information and advice. We move on to our first film now, which explains all that information and more in far more detail. It's the official new series launch video, and it's called simply the MF3000 Launch. The history of man's technological development charts a continuous battle for survival against the untamed elemental forces that exert such a huge and chaotic influence on our environment. Our need to harness the powers of nature, to contain them or to reproduce them, has seen our ideas take on a variety of ever more exotic shapes. Each plateau of accomplishment has been a stepping stone to the next, so that at the peak of scientific endeavor, the most advanced techniques in research and development and computer-aided design have been refined to enable man to live, work and play in space. Meanwhile, there is one area of activity fundamental to our survival on Earth, which has so far been left behind in the technological revolution. Now, the world's leading tractor manufacturer has taken the technology of the future and adapted it to meet the future needs of the farmer. Massey Ferguson have brought high technology down to earth. This is the Massey Ferguson 3000, the ultimate tractor for the 90s. High specification, high performance, high productivity, high technology, brought down to earth. The 3000 series has been developed without compromise to meet the uncompromising demands of our customers, to offer a greater range of benefits than any tractor in its class, to outperform any tractor on the market. We have listened to our customers, understood their concerns, and reacted by designing a tractor for the future. From the start, our team of design engineers quickly realized that this could not be done by adapting an existing design. 
The need was for a brand new clean sheet design that would revolutionize the farm machinery industry.